long-anticipated fifth installment of the franchise Indiana Jones is finally coming, and we can prove it. These were the movies many of us grew up with. The adventures Harrison Ford managed to go on were just over the top, and he's back at it again to do at least one more. So stick around as we take a first look and tell you everything we know so far about the upcoming sequel. Years in the making. You are going to play Indiana Jones again, which is very exciting. We can safely say that this next sequel has been years in the making. And today, Indiana Jones 5 is finally, genuinely in the works and ready to hit the big screen. In early June this year, we were able to see Harrison Ford as Indy, and if everything goes according to plan, we might see him in the spotlight as soon as next year. That is, if there are not more setbacks after the last one that eventually happened, but more on that a little bit later. There is a different man at the helm of this movie. Indiana Jones 5 is definitely happening, but Variety has now confirmed for the first time Steven Spielberg will not be directing the movie. Uh Replacing Steven Spielberg is James Mangold, who says that despite he is new to the franchise, he's confident that him, together with the team working on the movie, the whole crew will deliver and knock themselves out in the efforts to make something really good. After all, we deserve it, right? Many years have passed since the last Indiana Jones movie, so we are more than ready to be overwhelmed with excitement of what is coming. As Mangold said, he will try to capture the craft of the originals, which are going to be integrated with the modern age, all in order for the next sequel to be an epic one. Spielberg is still on board as hands-on producer, so the direction of the movie will not be taking some huge and unexpected turns. Don't you worry about that. And to mark the whole filming process on the way, we've prepared a little something to share with you about the release date of the movie, the cast members Mangold has decided to be paired with Ford, and of course, what the movie will be all about. Release date and trailer. Indiana Jones, they're saying that... I can, I can uh, uh, deny uh, that it's not happening. Like all other movies, this one was hit by the pandemic happening around the world and suffered further delays but not before the franchise itself had a few setbacks way before COVID-19 ever came to the spotlight. Long story short, the movie is scheduled to arrive in cinemas on July 29th, 2022. That is, if no further delays happen in the near future. However, let's take a look back at the rocky road the movie has been through and how it finally got to this point where it is at right now. There have been a few release date changes for the movie, some of which happened due to the extended development of the movie itself. The movie was supposed to be released in cinemas in July 2019, but the date shifted back to July 10th, 2020, only to be pushed by Disney again, even further down the line by another year, and the date being July 9th, 2021. And last but not least, another one year delay happened, and that is where we're at right now. The official release date right now being, as we mentioned before, on the 29th of July, 2022. There was also a little hiccup on the internet suggesting that the filming had shut down, but was quickly resolved as Mangold said, quote, we're all good, shooting. As for a trailer of some sort or a teaser footage, we'll probably have to wait until 2022, even though filming has started. And we're quite sure that this year, we will not get lucky enough to see a scene or two from the movie itself in any form of small footage. We'll just have to be patient. There might be a consolation prize for those of us who have waited long enough to get something from the set during filming or when it wraps up. Right now, we can only dream of it. Cast To start off, it would not be a shock to hear that Harrison Ford is coming back in the infamous role to put on the hat one more time. Producer Frank Marshall clearly stated that the role would not be recast for the new movie, one of the first pieces of news we got when rumors were spreading about yet another Indiana Jones movie. From the other confirmed cast members to take part in the next sequel, we would have to start with Phoebe Waller-Bridge, who has been cast as a female lead in the movie. Others who will be joining are Hannibal star Mads Mikkelsen, Seanette Renee from Black Panther, Marvel star Thomas Kretschmann, and Boyd Holbrook from The Predator all of which have been confirmed for the upcoming movie. The details of which character they will be playing are under wraps as of now, but Mickelson said that when it comes to the script, it's everything he wished for. When the filming began, we also got the news that Toby Jones also joined the cast of the new movie, along with Antonio Banderas, but in unknown roles, a detail we will have to wait a bit for. 
the legendary composer John Williams will also be present after being confirmed to return, continuing the journey he started almost 40 years ago with Raiders of the Lost Ark. John Rhys Davies expressed himself that he would want to reprise his much-loved role of Salah, who first appeared in Raiders of the Lost Ark, and then again in Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. We should also mention that Indy's love interest, Marion Ravenwood, might not be back. However, Karen Allen said that never say never, as we've seen her a part of the early stages of the filming of the movie. And last but not least, we've also heard that Star Wars star Mark Hamill has put himself out there as a potential villain in the fifth installment, but that is still out for debate. Plot we have had the pleasure to see the plethora of wonderful cast members who are joining the franchise, but when it comes to the details of just what kind of an adventure Indy will participate in, we've got nothing in particular. Everything has been kept well hidden that even Indy might not be able to find it. However, from some shots, it looks like Indy will go head-to-head -head with Nazis again, but the details are still not clear if it's some kind of a flashback or if they're the main villain in the movie. On the known side of things, we know that this sequel will take place after Crystal Skull, and that it will feature older Dr. Jones, with us seeing him in a different light, just like Harrison Ford announced. It has been over a decade since the last movie was released, and if the franchise follows Crystal Skull, which was set in 1957, we should expect the fifth installment to be set in the 60s, one of America's most turbulent decades. Some were wondering if the movie would be a reboot, but Kathleen Kennedy denied all those rumors to be wrong, a statement that perfectly lines up with the rumors of the new movie, including something to do with the space race. Mangold has not revealed anything about the movie's plot, but has said that like all his other movies so far, he will find an emotional center to operate from. This, in combination with his desires to push this franchise to someplace new, might prove to be just what Indy needs on his next adventure. Mangold was not shy to add that even though there were some things that have been happening repeatedly in the movies before this one, there are still a few elements that are there to capture the essence of the movie. The whole franchise lies on them, and he is more than certain that he will revisit some of them and make them part of what is yet to come. Thus, expect some nostalgia along the way in this next marvel of a movie that is releasing as soon as next year. On a related note, tell us down in the comments section below of all the previous installments, or to be precise, which one has been your favorite to rewatch and why? And also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.